Guys, this is To Live and Die. This is Dave Walker. The second game of this best of three in the semifinals on a Monday night. February the 4th, 2013. Upper left, we have Fat Chunk. He lost the last game to this uh, pretty good Terran who is in the bottom right, and he's yellow. Scuzzy, and uh, Scuzzy, man, he's on a roll. He is in the semifinals, and he just won this, this last game to make it 1-0. Two-player map yet again. Let's see what this Terran can do. He can mac macro up like a boss, can he? He does this, uh, I mean, he's been doing this uh, one racks expand into Hellion opening and getting a large and in charge army off of it. Uh, yeah, pretty good, guys. Pretty good from this uh, Terran player. Meanwhile, this Zerg player has to uh, wonder what in the world's going on. He's in the semifinals against a very good Terran. He has to pull out some stops here. I don't know, man. He has to let it all go. Let it all go, Zerg. Let's let it all go. Because this Terran is for sure. That Terran had a scary army there at about the 12, 13 minute mark. That was unbelievable. Alright, as I get my breath here a little bit. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Standard wall off for the Terran player. And it looks like we're going to have your standard opening for the uh, Zerg. Also, he's at the 14 supply. And probably going to get a natural here down soon. Oh, oh, no. Oh, you know what, guys? Scratch everything I said about Scuzzy. Because guess what? Guess what? He is going to go... He is going to go anti-normal. Abnormal build over here now. What is going on? Two racks proxied. Proxy two racks, or I don't know what you call this. Ninja two racks. <laughs> this is not really proxy because it's not kind of... It's not really that close to the Zerg base. I mean, he is at the north part of the uh, map, but... This is still a, quite a walk to get over here <laughs> to the uh, Zerg base. But anyways, a perfect placement for these uh, buildings because uh, that Overlord did not even come close to those racks. So it's a perfect placement for these racks. Yes, I am solo casting, Chris. Asian Vitality Viper. <laughs> All your names. <laughs> Chris Viper Asian fatality. So, anyways, the SCV goes into the into the main. Uh, normal timings here, but look if you look. Um, what what just happened here? Did the drone get inside the main base? What's, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh no! Oh, there wasn't a drone scout for Fat Chunk. Oh, Fat Chunk! Come on now, you gotta drone scout this man. This Overlord is not gonna see this in time. You you gotta get your Overlord down here to this base. I know you've been seeing him do the same build, but he's pulling out like a a different. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys. Guys. Do you see what I'm seeing on the screen? Look at this. What, what's what's this right here? Look at, look at all these things. And do you see what this is over here? This is Marines, man, coming out of nowhere. The Zerg's player is like, where do these Marines come from? Where in the world do these Marines come from? And guess what? These SCVs over are here. They're going to be building bunkers and all this kind of stuff. There's enough Marines here and to take care of any Zerglings that the uh, Zerg has. And Fat Chunk is now supply blocked. So he can't make any units right now. He has to make Overlords. Oh my goodness. Scuzzy is doing some cheese, some provolone, some... Oh my. Imported. I'm going to call it some imported Italian cheese right here. By Scuzzy. And finally Fat Chunk can make some units... That's right, imported ricotta cheese. Look at the uh, workers killed. 10 workers killed the 2. 13 now, 14 workers killed. Nothing that Fat, fat Chunk can do. 20 supply to 9. Oh, puts down <laughs> spine crawlers. <laughs> Is it enough? <laughs> oh, he gets the Zerglings out. Look at that. They just pop out. <laughs> can he hold this off? Can Fat Chunk pull off the miracle? 9 supply to 10. It's gonna happen. The Zerglings are here to save the day. Oh my goodness. Oh, Zerglings out in the nick. I mean, the nick of time. Like, if there was a timer on those Zerglings, like, they came out the split second before the timer went off. Oh. Yeah, that, that that's amazing. Now all I have to do, if, if he can surround these uh, the Marines... All right, never mind, never mind. Forget what I'm saying here because I don't know. I don't know what the meta game is in a situation like this. But uh, I gotta tell you, man, uh, 
let's, let's look at the uh, income just for a second. 180. See, the Terran still has a higher income. We got 180 to 340 or whatever it is. So even so, even after that, even after the Terran lost so much, he's still going to be ahead in the income right here, and uh, he's going to be able to make uh, a little bit more of an army than he can even. Oh, fat chunk! What are you doing? All right, Fat Chunk decides to counterattack with all of these earlings that he has, and he's going to try to break down uh, these uh, supply depots. And he got one burning, and GG from Scuzzy. Fat Chunk def 